biomedical technology, we use a combination of biology, medicine, and technology to improve medical science, medical equipment, and the diagnosis and treatment of medical conditions. It's great to be working here in a lab at Grand Valley. We get to work with state-of-the-art technology and all sorts of lab materials that are provided for us. I like doing it hands-on. I'm kind of a visual person. I really like the medical side of it. The research is interesting too. If you are interested in cellular or molecular biology, human anatomy and physiology, lab research, or scientific research, this class is for you. Right now, what we're doing is planaria research. Later on, we're gonna be doing genetic research on them. We will get into DNA and stuff, which I'm extremely excited about. We're learning about med terms right now. As the semester and the year goes on, we'll learn more about cell structure. In this course, we get to learn a lot from professionals, even like professors from Grand Valley State University. We've gotten like options like job shadow, and we're doing different like trips outside of here. Like we're going out to Lake Michigan later in the spring to do some research on the Grand Valley research boat. What we're learning in this program is equivalent to taking freshman biology at Grand Valley, only it's free. And we're getting a head start on our college career and earning credits in advance. We do get uh, receive seven college credits to any university that you wish to go to, and that puts you ahead of most students. Plus, you get actual experience and get to meet new inventors of high-tech therapies and discuss cutting-edge medical research and cures. My goal is to be a forensic scientist. I want to work in a forensics lab. I want to be like a pediatrician or like do something in pre-med. I'm interested in the medical field and I want to become a physical therapist. I plan to become a surgeon and this class is a really great place to start with that. My career starts here at Kent Career Tech Center. 